On the fifth night of the film festival in Jacksonville, one of the anticipated movies is North Star that's going to be screening at the Jacksonville Public Library. And with me is the writer, director, and producer Matthew Stanton of the film. Matthew, I don't really know if you're the right person to be speaking with because it doesn't sound like you had any hands-on yeah. <laughs> activity with this film. I know, actually. I'm, I, I'm not worthy of the opportunity of this invitation, but... We'll take it. Not at all. Tell us a little bit about the film. Well, North Star, um, we're actually competing in, or we're invited to participate and exhibit the film in a couple different categories. Um, I believe one is made in the U USA category series, mm -hmm. and then we're also a uh, celebration of black cinema um, featured here at Jacksonville um, International Film Festival. Um, North Star itself was shot entirely on location. It's a full narrative feature um, in the state of Texas. And um, it's definitely a southern story that we're really excited about. Um, How important was the location for the plot? Oh, it served. It's, it, it, it's very important because of the theme and the plot of the film. I needed to find um, an authentic voice to serve as not only a primary backdrop, but also a character in the film. And so this being a southern story taking place in Texas, it's fictional, but it resonates within a lot of truths and, you know, originality that it, location is really important. And in fact, location is one of the elements that, we, that we're really um, celebrating because of um, its ability to help really kind of channel a lot of the important or necessary elements of motion picture. So tell us a little bit about the plot from the characters. It really follows, it follows our lead character, um, handsomely portrayed by Jerome Hawkins. Um, the character's name is uh, Demetrius. Demetrius is a um, murder witness from inner city Houston, one of the ward districts. Um, unfortunately, he witnesses the brutal execution of his best friend. He therefore decides to change his life in a positive way and makes an exit out of the gang affiliation lifestyle. He ends up making a beeline across the state of Texas. En route, he's befriended by a black ranch hand, a character that I play, that introduces Demetrius to this fictional rural, really dark town that has a hidden secret. Together, Demetrius and myself, the character that I play, successfully conjure up a plan to kind of rouse the demons that haunt this tiny town and kind of flush them out and bury them once and for all. But this truly, simply said, North Star is a freedom song. It's about redemption um, and it's about getting yourself to a better place. How did you come up with the idea for it? Hmm. Well, North Star actually, um, the genesis of this film even though it's very um, chaotic and controversy, controversial and race and message sometimes, um, it really came to me in a song, a country music song. Really? And I was as far removed from country music at that time, but fortunately, I'm glad that I paid attention to the lyrics. And that's the thing, is that inspiration comes in so many different forms. And if you are available or open enough to pay attention to some of the things of your own interpretation, some of your own um, ideas, that you can actually kind of receive the echoes that you feel in your heart, your head, and kind of make a commitment, a con you know, a contact to that, and re you know that resonates within, and then just you know successfully tell these stories. That's so great. that's great. Now you've only been in Jacksonville since last night, mm -hmm, yeah. but what's your impression so far? I love it. You know, it's so refreshing and so rewarding to not only come to a region that embraces what you have to say, but share in the component of, um, you know, generosity. I mean, it's like just the hospitality as soon as I arrived at the airport. I was already in discussions about Jacksonville and my layover in Nashville, and so far it's lived up to my expectations. I'm really happy to see how well this film festival has taken on. Um, and the people that have coordinated all of the efforts to make something like this happen. So it's another, you know, this is my first trip to Jacksonville. However, it's something, it's a place that I definitely want to revisit. That's great. And what's next for you? Um, we're going to be just shopping North Star throughout the festival circuits throughout the calendar year 2008. Okay. Fortunately, we started our world premieres at Sundance this year. And every single month, I usually attend two, one to two festivals a month, and we take that all the way to, you know, the end of May. And then at some point, I'm going to have to get back in the studio, you know, smoothing out a couple rough edges. But our biggest objective for North Star is to find the right partnership, the right soulmate, the right home for the film. That's important. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, definitely. Well, the film, again, it's North Star. If you didn't get to see the screening, just be sure to check out the film festival website for more information. For Jacksonville.com, I'm Amanda Warford.